Hi, welcome to Horror News Radio. 2023 is starting off with a bang, sir. Christopher G. Moore is joining me today because we are going to take a look at the Evil Dead Rise trailer, which dropped just a little bit ago. Oh, my goodness. Christopher, you are a huge fan of Evil Dead. Of course, you've got the poster up behind you. I, I took my poster down from my living room <laughs> and put it in here just for this wonderful occasion of a new trailer for this film. All right. So what we want to do is we're going to we're going to play the trailer here now. And we're going to comment about it and have a quick discussion. We just want to share our, our thoughts and love for this trailer. Oh, my gosh, this year. And uh, I don't think the week is going to stop bringing us surprises this week oh my goodness all right should we just dive in are you ready yeah do it let's do it of course this is the red band trailer there's a green band one out as well yeah so be warned <laughs> it makes me cringe every time i watch this oh trailer. there's so much cringe in here that house that how the, the new cabin seems like either the midsummer <laughs> Building <laughs> or the church for Mandy. How much I want to cut you all open. Uh, climb inside your bodies. Climb inside your bodies. All oh, this part. Oh, Jesus uh, Christ. Christ. <laughs> oh, there it is. Oh. It makes me want to cut my hair off so I can be pulled oh, by the ponytail. I love the music choice. Love the music choice. Mm -hmm. Well, it, it's. Reminiscent of Evil Dead because there's always some kind of creepy song. And there's the book. Oh man, yeah, a new version how... of it at that. Oh man, look how good it looks. And also, Is we that... have a record instead of a of the, of the recording. Yeah, real to real tape. tape. Yep. Oh man. Oh man. I hope, that, I hope they release the score in vinyl and they make it like the record because oh. I would totally buy that. I love her voice. Looks so good, Bob. Nothing. A big old kiss from you won't fail. Oh, that's so great. Yeah. <laughs> the kids in danger. Santos would love it. Oh, no. No. <laughs> this part. Oh. Oh. Teeth. Did you see teeth? I'm getting this out of here. I promise. If you could mob someday, honey Oh, yeah. Yeah, you know how to fight the kids. <laughs> what is this? Oh, it's a shining moment. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's scary. Mom? Mommy's with the maggots now. Oh my god, green line! Oh my god. Coming in April. Oh my goodness. That looks so good. And this is the red band trailer. If you if you get a chance, watch the green band trailer as well because it actually it shows like where she gets attacked by the force when she's in the elevator and it shows a little bit of her transformation in front of the kids and stuff. Um it, it shows at one point they think she's dead and, and a fly lies on it flies on her eye so there's oh. and and I, I think the and the green band actually shows much more even the more of the kinetic sam raimi stuff but yeah you look at this it has elements from all of the evil dead films it has stuff from evil dead one evil dead two ash versus evil dead and the remake um, and the, yeah and the remake the it's also <laughs> it feels like it has homages of course to kubrick's the shining there's homages to like demons it feels like i mean there's homages to a lot of different things in this and that makes me really excited because I know that, you know, there's certain fan base that likes the the previous, was it 2013, I think, the previous remake, um, which was still connected. Um, but this, I don't know, this feels like the best of both worlds. This feels like it has that same raminess of the original trilogy. And it also has the visceralness because I, but I think it has, for me, it works because I didn't, I didn't like the characters in that previous film, but this one, I, you feel for the you already feel for the characters just watching the trailer because it's a family, you know. Yes. So I like it, changing it up that way too. Yeah, that, yeah. Because yeah, yeah. we all we always had in the original we had like we had the brother sister his sister changing and stuff. 
or his girlfriend changing. And this is what would happen if your mom changed. What would you do? Mm -hmm. You know, how would you deal with that? Um, but this one, it also has that kinetic energy that we always associate with Sam Raimi stuff that actually changed her, I think, for good. Because when the original Evil Dead came out, we're like, wow, what's all this crazy cam work? And you see that in this, you know? Um, yeah, and there's, I mean, the, the trailer, this Red Band trailer, man, I don't know about you. I, I cringed, I mean, that, the, at least three months at least yeah three yeah months yeah months. and oh i hate it. i you know i made a film about eye torture so i hate things going towards the eye so just that little i think it's a i think it might be like a tattoo gun or something yeah, looks, that. that might be a tattoo gun yeah um well the whole scraper on the leg oh man just, oh yeah yeah because uh, and, and they i'm i'm sure it goes further so just knowing what's what's gonna happen that's right gonna hurt that. that's gonna hurt and then the scrape um, and the scalping uh Oh, oh yeah man. yeah this this looks so good and i i'm pretty sure we're, we're just getting a taste there's so much more oh I'm yeah sure and, and like i said um the green band trailer shows even a little bit more of that because you see you know like we get the little like you know uh moms with the maggots line or whatever but in the green band at the very end she's like pointing to the people like saying eeny meeny miny mo and mm -hmm. so yeah i don't know i i've literally watched this trailer too many times today and then i've been watching <laughs> now i'm watching the green i'm alternating between the green band and the red band and maybe i shouldn't because i feel like i'm gonna know what's gonna happen but that's true at, at the same time i don't know i'm i'm i i, I love the energy of this you know it it yeah i, I don't know it, it it feels much different and um and i you know and it even makes me want to go watch the the original <laughs> remake as well so yeah, even the I'm, 2013 yeah 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 so i mean i don't know but th this looks like so much fun and i you know it's we have to wait what four months three months <laughs> three months yeah to april what's really great is that we started h and r episode one was evil dead and our 10 year anniversary is going to be evil dead rise oh well that's isn't just, that cool that's yeah again. and <laughs> as, as a lifelong evil dead fan that makes me very happy to be part yeah. of that process so yeah it's um i'm sure a lot of people were thinking ah oh, well i mean people had the issue before because we didn't have really we had a little in credit thing with bruce but but you know you can tell that bruce campbell and sam raimi are still producers on this so they're still and they've said this is one of the scariest evil deads since well, so okay so it was originally going to be hbo max and they pulled it to put in the theater so that's well, i that's, think that's a good sign it's confidence that this is going to be a good movie to see in with an audience with a whole mm -hmm. group of people everybody screaming together or going oh i can't believe it did that so yeah, i think this is going to do so well all right so one last question the woman coming out of the water what is that the woman oh i i, I think well i i think um and they show probably a little bit in the green band but i i feel like that we get a segment before we move to the la segment mm -hmm. to where we actually see like a played out people at a cabin the cabin on lake. a lake in this one yeah, yeah cabin on a lake you know story and i think that's one of the possessed people because uh because because i think the the initial thing with the record and stuff that's the people at the lake oh. and somebody gets possessed and somehow they bring that to la somehow mm -hmm. so because because that's why we get the flashback we see the mom and she's, she looks like purity you know she has the beautiful hair and everything but if you see the green band there's a there's a scene where she goes down in the basement and she gets she's getting laundry and that the you see the dead at cam go towards her into the elevator and that's why you see the scene where there's arms coming out of the top of the the elevator and stuff mm. I'm, I'm assuming it might be part of that but there's a part where you see her eyes roll up and her head and stuff but yeah going to go yeah yeah so, I, band trailer now. <laughs> so i'm assuming i'm assuming we'll probably get some little segments almost like you know almost like uh evil dead 2 where we get a little bit of sort of refresher kind of you know story that kind of bring somehow brings us to um la at some point uh, i am so looking forward to this uh we i want to hear your thoughts down below uh, and of course, if you're enjoying this, please hit the like, subscribe, share with a friend. Uh, every little click helps. And we hope you uh, uh, look forward to it. Maybe we'll do these more often. I have a feeling we're going to get a lot of really cool trailers in the next few months uh, because sure uh, 2023 is upon us. And uh, what, what a great start with a, this this trailer. Oh, my God. Oh, I, 
this was up my most anticipated list, and this is this shot's even beyond that. <laughs> if that could be possible, because no, 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 I'm so excited that I'm kind of done, you know, <laughs> dumbfounded. I have to wait three months for it to come out. So I agree. It shot up my list a little bit. It wasn't at number one, but it may, uh, it may. It, it is today, right now. <laughs> well, and, and some people were a little bit worried because you have that the new poster that came out that people are comparing to the smile poster. But um, but I think this trailer is making everybody sort of like, uh, mommy loves you to death. I love that. Mommy's, <laughs> with, mommy's with the maggots now. Oh my god, that's a great line. All right, well, let's get out of here, Christopher. Thank you for joining me. This was a lot of fun. Oh yeah, I'm I'm, I'm so excited. That about this film and i can't wait for us to review it uh, in april all right we'll see you in the theaters let's get out of here all right good night